we look at things in year cycles and Beijing was amazing for me and then after that I was focused on the World Championships and all my training went towards that and it paid off, it, it really did, everything went well. I swam the best I could, obviously um, I came away with becoming world champion which is, you know, just incredible but to do it in a world record time as well and take that away with me, you know, that's something I'm going to never forget and um, Rome's a pretty special place for me so it's, it's been incredible. I'm really excited about being named as part of the British Grass Duel in the pool team for for the E-Stars, really, which is um, which combines um, part of Britain, part of Germany and part of Italy um, to race against the Americans. So it's a pretty exciting time for me. It's just before Christmas. It's at the end of our short course season. And it's a, it's a good tester, really. And I think everyone's really excited about being part of it. I think this is going to be the first time Michael Phelps is actually over in Britain competing in Manchester, which is fantastic. Obviously, we got the we got the London Olympics in three and a bit years' time, so everyone's excited about that. They're coming over to test the waters over here, and um, yeah, it's just fantastic to have such a, an array of great athletes over here, and it's going to be a real spectacle for the uh, spectators, really. We're going to go out there and, and give it our best, but ultimately we're, we're there to have fun and swim fast, and that's what we're all there to do. I competed in Beijing in 2008, and um, you know my main focus is now towards 2012 in London, and um, it's now into the 990 days or so to go to, into the Olympics, which is you know incredible. And every day that passes, we're really going to get excited. The British public are going to get more and more excited leading into the Olympics, and you know day by day that's going to grow. I can't wait till 30 days to the Olympics when the excitement's going, the crowd's going crazy, you know, and, and, and the day we stand up behind that block and, well, give it some for Britain, really.